Alright, well good morning. It's day two of our build. We've got concrete coming here in about uh, oh, three hours or so. So we've got a few uh, last minute touches for our footings. We're going to dig out our footings. We've got to crumb them out and square up the walls and the side walls and then um, where our uh, footing, our excavation meets our round grain bin foundation, we got to crumb that out and square it up. And then we're going to drill a uh, rebar and set all of our rebar for our footing. Introduce my boys. There's Nathan. And Joe. Hey, Joe. Morning. Good morning. Kind of a family project. <laughs> this is for Grampy and Nana. We got a lot of work ahead of us, so we're going to get after it here before concrete comes. All right, we got to establish our height for our footing. Um, this is the front porch. We're going to be laying a block foundation. Um, I'm going to lay two courses of block with a solid cap, and then we're going to pour a four inch concrete um, stoop on top of that to cap that off. So my finished floor is going to be uh, the same height as our, our uh, concrete foundation for our silo. Uh, this is actually going to be the floor height inside the building too. That way we've got uh, no step through the doorway, nice and gentle for um, uh, grandparents going in and out this cap will probably have a little bit of fall to drain away from the building but uh, for my footing here to lay my block um, I need to come down four inches for my cap that would be my overall top of my block height I'm gonna lay two courses so I'm gonna measure down 16 inches and that'll be the height of my footing I'll probably leave my footing just a little bit low maybe a quarter inch low yep. we got our laser turned on here uh, we got to establish our height with our grade stake for our top of our footing. So when we pour our uh, concrete here, we can just uh, shoot the top of our footing and drag our concrete to level. Uh, also, we can use this. We're gonna drive in our uh, vertical rebar stakes and tie off all of our rebar and make sure it's roughly in the center of our footing. So uh, we're gonna get it set up here. Uh, and then I've got to drill two continuous rebar into this footing and lay two continuous rebar all the way through these footings. So we're getting ready to get started on that. That's probably good enough.
report our first truck out. So a one full truck backyard. We're about uh, halfway through the front door, so back forward. So we're gonna need another three yards or so. Well, we got our footings poured for our back and half the front. And it looks like uh, our second concrete truck is arriving right now. There he comes. 